Hi, it's Chris Crocker here in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center on Thursday. And I am very excited to tell you we're going to get a little bit of sunshine. That's the good news. Uh, if you're not a fan of the cold, we're also going to cool things down a little bit. Not cold by January in the inland northwest standards, just a little below average. Well, here are four things uh, that you need to know about the weather. It is going to be sunny on Friday. We do have a cooling trend uh, that takes us down into the teens Saturday morning. That's as cold as it's going to get. Uh, we have the possibility of some snow late Sunday. Here's a look at our satellite and radar. And we did have a little bit of very light snow down on the Palouse and the LC Valley uh, today. A little bit of rain mixing in too. That is going to be coming to an end later this evening and we will be dry overnight clearing skies overnight as well. Kind of slow to clear from the Palouse and the LC Valley. Here's our computer model forecast. 8 o'clock tomorrow morning still hanging on to some fog and low clouds but then we begin clearing uh, more substantially and we're all going to get some sunshine on Saturday. Here's a look at our upper level winds and you'll notice we're getting into a northerly flow. Uh, most of the energy in terms of precipitation well to our east until we get into late Sunday and then that system out there in the Pacific moves in and it looks like it is going to bring widespread snow but widespread light snow uh, looking at precipitation totals in the uh, one to two inch range so pretty light overnight lows tonight. Haven't seen these numbers in a while. Down in the teens at Colville, Deer Park, Sandpoint and Bonners Ferry will be in the lower to mid-20s around Spokane and Coeur d'Alene with high temperatures tomorrow just a little bit below average. And then we get even further below average for Saturday. Again, that is when our cooling trend uh, bottoms out at 30. But we don't really warm up that much through the forecast. Uh, those temperatures in the lower 30s, more typical of early January than late January and uh, a lot of snowflakes on that map but each day it looks like just a fast moving quick hit of light snow no big storms on the horizon if that changes I will update you um, in the meantime enjoy some so I don't even think people are really going to notice that it's cooled down on Friday and Saturday because of the sunshine just sort of makes everything seem so much uh, more pleasant might notice it on Sunday when the clouds move in but uh, in the meantime we'll see you back here tomorrow or tonight on 4 News Now Nightside at 11 o'clock thanks for watching